Welcome to the line of Minnie, Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Train. I tried to get a light in the lane, but it's obviously going to be a very busy, busy day because it all sold out. So we're just waiting in line right now. Um, it says 45 minutes. Um, park opened about 10 minutes ago for early access. I've already been on Rise of the Resistance. It is amazing. So this isn't very exciting, just a load of lines, but it's nice temperature at the moment. You don't mind being out outside. So I'm just moving along. Observations, Run Disney event has started. So this morning, I think some people did a 5K and they're here with their medals. So it's making the parks busier because there's all these crazy runners about. And um, a lot of small children. So about five o'clock today, the tantrums will be starting. Um, and that'll probably be when I hit the alcohol at Tap House. Creepy corridor for the symbol riders. This is where we always die. So um, I'm visiting Batu. It's a lovely place, but it's quite busy. There's some people that love to buy animals. There's ones that they go on the shoulder. I find it a little creepy. You can buy the cloaks, so you know you can look like a Jedi. You can buy some popcorn with some cool flavourings and you can buy what I can only describe as the most amazing kind of hot dog that is a Ronto wrap it's like in a flatbread it's just cool the resistance is strong here I better keep moving it's just not safe Love Woody's lunchbox. Who knew grilled cheese tasted so good? Oh, delightful. 
such a good quick service. So photos, snap snap, and then I went for a little wander into the Walt Disney Museum-y thing. So it's really interesting to find out about how they grew the parks and stuff like that. <laughs> people on the skyline are from pop coming here who were like Disney Disney Park like hardcore people so we were having all kinds of talks about it which was really good um, and so they adopted me and we went on Rise of the Resistance and it was like a 20 minute wait we literally like got into the park and like power walked all the way there so then um, after that I did Mickey and Minnie's Runaway and it was really good and then all day I've just been doing my Genie Plus and like getting on rides and I've done the shows um, I have to say Indiana Jones is quite an interesting one but I wouldn't watch it again and then I did Beauty and the Beast which I really liked it it was like 20, 25 minutes and it was like the highlight show so it kept a lot of attention from what we know now I've got a good top tip for everybody if oh I've got some stormtroopers walking around so um top tip smugglers run it was 75 minutes standby I went in the single rider you go down a corridor and you have to pick left or right always pick left because within five minutes I was going my hair looks fantastic this morning and I'm not even saying it. The photographer that I had outside, well, sorry about that, we just got some uh, some uh, vehicles landing in Batu. Anyway, I'm leaving Batu and I'm heading into Toy Story. So anyway, I was on with my story. So just outside of um, the Tower of Terror, I got my pitch taken and the guy was like, I love your hair. And he was like, you're so beautiful. And I was just like, this is the type of photographer I need just to like come with me wherever I go. <laughs> like, I need a hype man. <laughs> so I have a reservation for Primetime 50s Cafe, which is apparently meant to be really funny because it's meant to be like they're your cousins and you, you know, you got to eat your greens and wash your hands and all that. But that's at 7.40. There's no more Genie Pluses that I can get right now. So it's literally like if I want to ride something, I just have to queue. So I'm looking at all the wait times and they're quite long. So I'm going to see how long Slinky is. Oh, I lie, I lie. I've still got alien sauces at 8, 8.30, I think. My plan is to stay here and see some of the fireworks. Um, like do a full session here it's been absolutely heaving like I'm not even kidding like it's been ridiculous here but now right now it's starting to ease and the temperature is beautiful it's like just so nice for walking around I love Toy Story Land it's just amazing so just gonna see what I can do for a couple of hours. I might hit the tap house for a beer. You can get a flight, so I might try that. You know, 
you know, there's nothing to do. You just start drinking, don't you? <laughs> That's what us Brits seem to do. Having such an amazing time, like, I'm just absolutely loving it. And I've got guys a week on. left. Linda. I just can't believe it, I've got a week left. Right, okay, I've got to decide what I'm gonna do now. Hello, Minnie, how are you? You look absolutely fantastic. Give me, oh yes, a curtsy. We're very good at that in England, because we may need the queen. <laughs> but you are a queen here. Yeah, she's our style yes, you are. All the magazines have your face on them. Yes, and you are the fashionista of this place. <laughs> Especially with your bow. Yes, and it's jeweled. And then you've got this one as well. Oh, wow, you have the whole outfit. Now, is it okay if we have a little photograph? Yes. Just hanging out in my dad's uh, lounge while waiting to eat with my cousins. So this is a separate section of where Prime 50s is. And I've got a telly here, so this will keep me entertained with my Long Island. It'll probably be very lethal. Hello, so you can hear that music. I am chilling in prime time in the lounge, or dad's lounge, with my cocktail. It's a Long Island iced tea, it's one of my favorites, but I always forget. In America, they don't measure up the portions, so this is lethal. If I had a few of these, I'd be dancing in the pond. So, um, just waiting for my meal. I already know what I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have fried chicken. This will be the third fried chicken of the week because you know there ain't no fried chicken like an American fried chicken. And it's oh, the fried chicken I have had so far has been amazing. And if you've been watching me, you know I've been eating for England as if I'm never going to eat again. <laughs> But I have been walking for miles. Today's been a very um, slow day. Because I haven't even hit 20,000 steps. And it is 7 o'clock. Hollywood is probably one of the smaller parks for walking around. But I've really enjoyed just walking around. It's been so busy though. Um, I've just done uh, Tower of Terror. And that was an hour's wait. But it was like a ride I really wanted to do again because I really enjoyed it. And I normally hate rock rides, but that one's fun. It's fun because of hearing everybody scream. <laughs> it's just like a really good atmosphere. Um, so yeah, so I've got um, Alien Sauces booked for after this. But I don't think spinning and fried chicken is maybe a good mix. But they also have a show and fireworks at 9 o'clock. So I'm going to do that. Um, so fingers crossed, fingers crossed, I get out of here in time to watch all of that. It's literally outside the door, so I should be okay. And then um, tomorrow I've got booked in Magic Kingdom again. Um, I haven't done Splash Mountain, I need to do Splash Mountain before it shuts. But I have a poncho, so um, I'm gonna go enjoy my meal and enjoy some fireworks and then that's another day gone um this time next week i'll be on a plane and i'll be crying my heart out this has honestly been the best holiday of my life so far and don't feel lonely when you're solo here because there's so much to do 
um, and just constantly doing things and entertained and so busy but it is honestly um, very tiring I'm so glad that I built up my stamina for walking because my feet are fine I'm absolutely fine but um, but I was averaging about 15,000 steps to 20,000 a day for like the month before so to me this just feels like a normal day so I'm just warning you now like build up the stamina because this is a marathon not a sprint guys this holiday is hardcore it's like boot camp this was not the night I was expecting so the chicken was okay but I've had better and the service which is what I came for just wasn't there like he hardly spoke to me I actually went to guest relations at the exit of the, the park and explained it she totally got it um, she got me this genie plus redemption but it really knocked me so I obviously had to have some ice cream to make me feel better after that meal